Good morning ladies and gentlemen. Today I'm going on a cycle route, believe it or not, of all bloody places. And I'm going to burn all these cars off because I've got to get past this lorry up here. <laughs> I've got to fly me f***ing helmet now. Oh shit, it's in me here. Oh. No, 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 don't go in me here, don't go in me here. It's in me f***ing here. God, why have I got so much bloody shit on? Bastard! Anyway, it's a bit cold today. Uh, although people don't seem to think that it is, it's 14 degrees. Uh, so I've had to put my gloves on, which again is sponsored by my f***ing pocket. It was my lovely sister who told me about this. Apparently, you go down here, you go to the end, and it's on the end, and it looks like it's going to bloody well rain. So this is supposed to be the longest cycle track in, in Stafford, and a lot of cyclists use it to commute, so I'm going to use it to take the piss. <laughs> uh, no, I'm not. Here I am. <laughs> Why is this woman leaking? She's got a leak mark down her back. Oh yes! I oh, ain't gonna put these bloody cycle gates all down the bloody place, are you? Oh shit! Oh, that's alright. Oh, lovely! 31 miles an hour! The road is obscured by human beings, I don't know what to do. Thank you! Morning. Morning! The one thing I don't like about this is a lot of bloody flies. Why is there so many flies? And old people. Careful dear. That's it, that's it. I don't like going fast along places that are obscured by human beings in case you kill them in the face. Oh, shall we go over a road here? What's that, 55? Is that the speed limit? Turn my light off. Is that the speed limit, 55? Miles an hour. Yep, done that. It's just full of dog walkers, there's no bikes on it. Is this a cycle track or a dog walking path? Bloody hell, I can see about a mile in the distance, it's just completely straight. Apparently this used to be an old train line, which is probably why it's straight, Tony, you dickhead. Another bridge. wonder when that was erected. Yeah, I ain't going up there. I'm rather glad I put my um, uh, full gloves on because I would have been in a bit of pain now because of all the nettles and everything else sticking out from here. I've been whipped a few times, I can tell you. Oh. Obstacle course. Oh yeah, that would have hurt. Oh God, that, oh, that would have hurt. That was a bramble. Another bridge. I should go that way, shouldn't I? Yeah, I'm gonna have to go that way. Bloody cyclists. 
wonder why she gets stuck behind a bloody cyclist. How is this man actually going down here in shorts? There's nettles, absolute thorns and God knows what everywhere. What a man in lycra. <laughs> White flowers, what are them? Tulips, no. Crocus, no. Rhododendron, I ain't got a clue, I don't know what f flowers are, I'm a f bloke. As you may have seen, uh, or may not, I don't know for showing it, I've got the new BMS for version 4, now I need to explain something. What happened was, is Mr Chinaman sent me an email and he says, Harrow, uh, that's how they speak, um, I'm going to say this in fluent Chinese now, Harrow, there you go. Uh, he sent me an email and he said that um, the version 1 app, not version 2, version 1, doesn't work with um, the 32S BMS. So I sent him an email back saying hello, because I'm English, he's not, he's Chinese, so he speaks with a Chinese accent. Is that cow shit? No, oh, I don't want cow shit all over me. Uh, I sent him an email back saying hello. And I said unfortunately I haven't got a 32S BMS so I can't really do a lot about it. And he replied with, give me a dress, I'll send you one. Oh wonderful. And I replied with, please send me the 300 amp version. So he said, okay. Five days later, UPS, <laughs> I got a BMS. Now what I didn't tell him was, uh, number one, version one of eBMS isn't upgradable to version two if you actually download the APK. Uh, if you download it from the App Store it is. Actually on the App Store only version two is available now, version one I think has been deleted. Uh, the other thing I didn't tell him was how bloody easy it is to change it. It's literally a line of code. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was there. <laughs> I ain't going to tell him, am I? It's free. Why would I? I was up at one o'clock this morning. I was bored. You know how it is when you get bored with sleeping. I just got up. Got nothing better to do. So I thought I'd sit there and edit videos and stare at the ceiling. Bang me head up the wall a few times. Seems to help. Why is the push bike beating me? Totty. I'm gonna go back up that road lane, uh, train line. Hopefully there won't be any uh, traffic this time, apart from the occasional human. I'm exploring my surroundings. It's deserted round. It's, it's like bloody four o'clock in the morning. Where is everybody? Why are the shops shut? Does just, just nobody live in Nosal? Is that the way it works? Nobody, oh god, no, can't live in Nosal. Oh, no. oh, ow. Hi. Morning. I saw you on that bike at Stafford. I was quite intrigued by it. Did you? What, um. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> I know it's an electric bike. Uh, what sort of performance does it have? What is it? Perhaps it must do 30 miles an hour, I would have thought. It'll do 77, 76 miles an hour. You're kidding. No. It, I built it all myself, everything's all made, all that's carbon fibre, all made by myself, designed, built and fabricated myself. Good God. Um, basically every part of it's all built by me. All the electronics are in the bottom here. The speed controller, the motor, as you can see, is on the back. I think it's wonderful. You're very clever to be able to make. Uh, what sort of range does it do? Uh, about 60 mile. Just 60 miles. 60 mile at about 30 miles an hour. That's 30 miles an hour. That's a wonderful bit of kit. It yeah. took about seven months, I think. Yeah. Um, I mean, it is. It's set up for street legal. It's got main beam. It's got a horn on there. It's got absolutely everything. The headlights and everything. <laughs> that's a camera on it, is it? There. Yeah, the GoPro, that's just in case, just for people, you know, when you're on the road, you know how dangerous it, how dangerous it is. Yeah. It's just in case anything happens and I've got some evidence on my camera at all. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and you've only built the one, you're not going to build them? 
Oh, this is version three. Um, I'm designing version three, version four, yeah. out of a, a a moped frame, which is going to have about twice the power. It should be able to do about 100 miles range. So hopefully, that's going to take about 12 months to build that one, though. Yeah. And what sort of value would you put on them? You can't buy anything with this amount of power. You can't buy it anywhere in the world. No. You have to build it yourself. Safe yes, and you, mate. <laughs> you, you're the first cyclist I've seen that actually appreciates what I've done. Oh, it Usually it's, uh, don't like you. <laughs> Wonderful. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, my friend. Nice to meet you. Yes, and you. Cheers, Cheers mate. I, I'm, I'm completely, completely gobsmacked. I thought that every single cyclist just hated me. I'll tell you what, folks, if you live in Stafford, I mean, you, well, number one, you know about this place, but if you want a bloody good rip out, this is an absolute fantastic place to go. Oh, although there's a bit of mud on it. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, yes. Oh. Bloody hell, this is getting a bit dodgy. Really dodgy. Oh, shit, me. Oh. Oh, that was a bit of a bit of adrenaline. <laughs> morning. if anybody's done this track at this bloody speed before. <laughs> it's a good job I've got bloody sunglasses on otherwise I'd have no f eyes left. Ow! It's getting bloody painful. Brakes, 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 brakes. <sighs> Was that it? Oh no. There's this bit as well, isn't there? This is getting a bit uncomfortable on my bloody arse, I tell you. Him. Her. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Me bollocks. Oh, that hurts. Oh my god. Oh, that was. So Look at the tyre mark. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was close. <laughs> oh dear. That could have ended very, very, very badly. I hate those Citroen C1s. Has anyone ever driven or been in, sat in a Citroen C1 and thought there's something wrong with it, even if it's brand new? <laughs> I've never known such a bag of shit in all my life. I started it up, I know they've got three cylinders, but oh my god, is it bad. Oh, big bottom.
Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to head back home now because I've got no bloody battery left. Well, I have. I've got you know, 74 volts, which is the storage voltage, which is what the voltages are like to be going home with. Uh, oh, you dickhead. Don't you dare. And I'll catch you next time. I hope you enjoyed this boring video, apart from I nearly died a couple of times. I'll catch you next time. And remember... Life is definitely worth living on this measly earth. All you've got to do is get out there, do the things that you enjoy every single day, and bollocks to what anybody else thinks.